How's it going? Josue back again with another video on Hear Me Raw. And as you can see, I am out in nature. I am still in the middle of like stretching. Just taking in the day, just really enjoying life, taking the time to enjoy this experience, to, you know, to see the wonder in the world. Because we take the wonder out of the world. We take the wonder out of the world with all these labels, all these words. We try to define something that is infinite. We try to put something that is infinite, that, that goes on and on and on, that will always be here. And we try to define it, you know. When you define something, you kind of freeze it in time. You, you, it's like you're trying to, con you're constricting it. You're limiting it. And that's the thing with words, you know. Words are a system. Words are spells. Words are magic. Literally, words are magic. We can literally do whatever we want. Anything that we can think, we can manifest. And that's how everything has always been in this world. Because if you think about it, and even in our dreams, when we dream things, when we visualize things in our dreams, it's happening to us. That's magic. When we, when we are looking at somebody doing something, and, we are, exp and we're, we, we are looking at it, we are experiencing it as ourselves. So this video actually today is going to be a video about reflection. And I'm going to be talking to myself essentially. Um, but you guys can take this message for, your, for yourself as well. It's what I always do. These, these videos are for me. These videos are me reflecting my thoughts, putting my thoughts out there. But I'm putting them on the web so that they can connect to you. So like my message, me, who I am, can go out all around the world. And by people seeing me being me, they would choose to be them. They would choose to, to connect to their higher self, to be different, to be weird, to be crazy. Because <laughs> let's, let's admit it, we are all crazy. Like, you think about it, we are all crazy. Like, this world is crazy. This world is bananas. Banana. <laughs> My friend Nick got me hooked to that song, Banana. <sighs> but, yes, we are all crazy. I mean, you think about it, this, this world is bananas. And why not just be crazy? Why not just be? Why not just exist? Why not just create? Why not just do what we came here to do? And that's what I'm here to inspire, for us to do what we came here to do. As you can see, nature, nature as you can see, I think it's as, as you can see, as you can see, nature has us covered. Like, look at that. I got a place to put my shirt, and I got some sun. Got this beautiful water in front of me. Of course, you know, we don't go in the water here. But, you know, we got to get the land clean enough so that way, we, whoever, wherever we are, we can just go to the water whenever. Because the water is always calling our name. Like, you know, we're made mostly of water. And water is such a beautiful, beautiful thing. Like, who, we will never know. We'll never be able to exp explain what water is. But water is literally life. This is life, guys. This is life. This is life. This is life. This is life. I'm surrounded by life here. How, how do you not want to live when you're surrounded by life? So we gotta start taking care of our lives. We gotta start taking care of our life. And our life is all this, is the planet, it's the earth, it's the animals, it's the, the air, the water, the earth. We gotta start taking care of it because that is us. Without it, we can't exist. You know, life is all about relationships. So in this video, I wanted to actually kind of say that I'm very grateful like that I'm so grateful for my life. I'm so grateful for every single thing that has ever happened to me. I'm so grateful for even my kidney stones that are so painful, you know? But I'm very grateful for them because everything that has happened to me, I'm grateful for everybody in my life. The people that I, I have hated, the people that make me angry, the people that make me happy, every single person that has, you know, came and left my life or is still here, I'm so grateful for. I'm so grateful for everyone and everything. I'm grateful for life. I'm grateful for it all because all of it, everything that I that I have experienced has led to me being the person that I'm here right now, has led to this, has led to this exact moment. <laughs> How perfect is that? You can't make this stuff up. See, like, you can't make that up. How perfect is that? <laughs> got an orange brown dragonfly oh, there was another one in my stomach too <laughs> see you can't make that up you cannot make that up I love love life there's another one there <laughs> you gotta love life you gotta love life I love every, every part of it every part of it the good and the bad the one saying that I have is that it's all good it's all good it's all God even the Bible says this, God is everywhere. God is everything. God is always watching, right? 
is because you are always watching. You are the universe experiencing yourself. So, like, there's no bad. It's contrast. To, to, to appreciate the good, you have to know the bad. You know, some people don't believe that, but honestly, I love the bad times. I love the quote-unquote dark times because that's when I grow. Yes, I'm struggling, but I'm growing. Like, you know, we need stress in order to grow. We need something to push us in order to grow. Otherwise, we're just going to lay back and just be lazy. And even the thing, in, the thing about it is you can actually sit back and be lazy and grow. So you just experience this and you take the path of least resistance. You know, in nature, everything happens effortlessly. You don't see any animals struggling in nature unless, you know, we get in the way. We're messing up their homes and things like that, which we need to stop doing. But you see that they have fun. They get to, they get to enjoy the sun. And they, they get to be themselves. And they, guess what? They take care of the ecosystem. Look at that. You know, do you see a lot of human work being done here to take care of this water? It's self-sustainable. Like, it's just, we just have to get out of its way. And we have to not do what we are, what we are doing to the other lands, you know? Drinking and just throwing trash everywhere. Polluting the water with plastic. You know, we're doing all of that to ourselves. All of our diseases are caused from within. They are caused by our thoughts. And it's because it's these thoughts of separation, these thoughts of fear, these thoughts of lack. These thoughts are draining us of our life, and we're not even knowing it. And as within, so without. So if we're draining ourselves of our lives, we end up draining the earth because it's the same. It's all connected. It's one. It's one consciousness. So I want to say that I'm thankful for the good, the bad, the ugly. I'm grateful for it all. I'm grateful for, for the hard moments, the good moments. I'm grateful for it all because it led to this. And I love who I am. I may not be perfect, but I love who I am. I'm not striving to be perfect. I don't need to be perfect. I believe the fact that I am imperfect makes me perfect because if I was perfect, I would be very, very boring. I'd be very predictable. But right now in this life, you got to enjoy the imperfections. Nature is not like a square or circles. Like nature is everything. Nature is just nature, and the fact, and look at it, like, you, do you see, like, perfection and symmetry and all this stuff? This is just literally life, and it is so beautiful, and we come out here and we enjoy it. We naturally just enjoy this. We don't, we don't go around nature saying, oh, there's too much dirt over here, there's too much this over here, like, we need to cut it, you know, like, fix it. No, we just let it be. We just let it be and enjoy it. And animals, too, we let them be and we enjoy them, but because we have been separated, because... We have been defining things and putting labels on things. Now we're taking some animals out of the environment. We're destroying a lot of environments. We're doing all this and that, which is not necessary at all. So we have to connect to ourselves. So we have to, be, we have to start to be grateful for life. Let's not focus on like the quote-unquote bad times and, and become a victim. Let's empower ourselves and, and know that the bad times are happening in order to push us forward. The bad times are happening in order... To, to make us grow, to evolve, in order to force to experience more of ourselves, you know? We get to experience more of ourselves. Yeah, right now you're in a good place, and you just want that good place to last forever. Don't you want to see what you're able to do given certain circumstances? This is a game. This is a movie. This is a musical. And we're all playing it together. How beautiful is that? We're all playing it together. <laughs> We're all in this together. Back, that's a flashback to what? What was that called? The Bobcats or whatever? No, high School Musical. Yeah. The li life is a musical. So I'm telling you, just I'm thankful for it all. I'm thankful for tomorrow. I'm thankful for everything. I'm just so grateful for this life that I live. And, you know, truly, you know, I am blessed. And you are blessed. We are all blessed. If we are, any of us that are alive here... Like, we are blessed. We are living here in the present moment. We are here right now in this magical, magical moment. There has never, ever, ever been another moment like this one, quite like this one. There's never been and there never will be. And we just experiencing it. Now the next one is coming. Let's, let's just experience it. Let's just love life. Let's just live. Let's just be. Let's just love. Because we are love. Ultimately, we are love. We are, we are that love frequency. And we feel our best when we are vibrating at that love frequency. We feel... The, you know, when we go towards the path of least resistance, when we're not trying so hard and we're just being ourselves or being love, we're showing love, we're expressing love. When we do that, anything is possible. You realize that when you're vibrating from love within, everything outside of you is just beautiful and works the way that it should. Because that's how, that's how you get in alignment. You become love. You strive your best to be love in every moment. And if you fail, that's okay because failure is a part of life. Just to be able to walk, you have to fail many times. 
this phone that I'm using right now, before it, before it became real, before it became an object, they, you know, they failed. They experimented, they failed, they tried different designs, and now this is the design that they have, and it's awesome, it's amazing. But they had to fail. If they never failed, they never would have got here. You know, if they failed and they stopped, this never would have happened. So, and if uh, many of us have failed and stopped, this beautiful world would never have happened. We, all of us that exist now, wouldn't be happening. So let's just... Let's just enjoy it all, guys. <laughs> I love you guys. I love you. I love you. I love you. And, you know, go out there and spread some love. Remember, what you put out is what you get back. So put out some love and you get back some love. And do your best to avoid the fear because, you know, we don't know the whole truth of it. And even if it is true and bad things are happening around the world, doesn't mean that we have to focus on that. We can choose what we want to focus on. And what we focus on, we bring more to our lives. So let's not focus on the suffering and bring more suffering. Let's focus on, love, on the love, the connection, the community. Let's focus on the fruits, because the truth is in the fruits. Let's focus on, you know, the life that we want to live. Let's focus on having some, you know, a lot more green in the world, a lot more water, clean water for everybody. Fruits for everybody. The truth is in the fruit. So let me guys, let me give you guys another view of the water. That absolutely beautiful. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.